What's up? Yeah, so for my book this quarter, I chose The Hunger Games. Yes, I'm aware that everyone and their mother have already read this. However, I'm an uncultured little man-child who still plays with Transformers and never read it until, well, the school year. So The Hunger Games this very early 2010s dystopian book. You mainly follow the characters Cadmus Everdeen and Peter Malark. They're both very impoverished and neglected members of society as they come from District 12. District 12 is one of the 12 districts from Panem, a nation of post-apocalyptic North America. Very original setting. Panem society consists of the 12 districts along with the capital. The basic gist of the district system is the lower the number, the richer the district, with the capital being the incredibly wealthy upper class. By a stroke of incredibly terrible luck, Cadmus' sister gets called up to join the Hunger Games, a blood sport in which two members of each district fight to the death in Battle Royale type manner. Because Cadmus loves her 12 year old sister and doesn't want to see her quite literally brawl to the death on national television, Cadmus volunteers for the Hunger Games in place of her sister. This is where she meets Pete along with a few other notable characters such as Effie Trink and ever so lovable former District 12 winner Alcoholic Hamish, the closest you can get to emo without being emo. It's a very long story short, Cadmus and Peter have to team up in the Hunger Games to survive and get way more sponsors shout them than literally anyone else in the Hunger Games, specifically because Peter has a very, very open crush on Cadmus. Yeah, did I mention Peter liked Cadmus? Pretty messed up. Okay, so yeah, this review is pretty much useless considering you should be ashamed if you're over 12 and haven't read already, but nonetheless, I want a good grade, so here we are.